My involvement with the State Bar has meant a lot to me, both professionally and personally. The Iowa State Bar Association has made it possible for me to develop uh, as a lawyer, as a person, and uh, to advance my professional goals, my professional uh, aspirations. Without the Bar Association, I, I don't think I would have had the opportunity to do some of the things that I've done and had great, great uh, enjoyment, uh, great satisfaction. Established in 1874, the Iowa State Bar Association stands as the oldest voluntary state bar association in America. With a membership of over 7,800 lawyers and judges, the Iowa State Bar Association serves close to 90% of Iowa's lawyers. It uh, has been a part of my professional life. Uh, uh, it has enriched my professional life. Uh, the uh, the uh, professional associations that I've made with fellow lawyers, uh, with judges, uh, uh, has added a, another dimension to my professional life. For over 132 years, the Iowa State Bar has served its members as well as the communities they work in. The Young Lawyers Division has a rich history of public service in different areas uh, in the state, and that allowed me to be involved in that and to promote it, uh, whether it be through uh, the Know Your Constitution project, the mock trial, or any of the other number of projects that we do as a bar association. Throughout the history of the Iowa State Bar Association, the location of the headquarters has changed numerous times with one thing in common. The State Bar has never owned its own building until now. Seeing the need for a permanent facility, the Board of Governors voted unanimously for building ownership. An existing building was purchased and is now being renovated. After 132 years of leasing, the Iowa State Bar Association will have a place it can truly call home. This is an older building. It's now been de designated as a historic place. Uh, it has a lot of character. I like the location of it very much because it's easy to get to, close to the, uh, the Supreme Court, close to the Capitol, uh, easy to drive to. Located on the corner of East 7th and Court Streets in downtown Des Moines, the 15,000 square foot structure will undergo an extensive renovation while still retaining its historic charm. We're going to be in the same neighborhood, if you will, right next door to the Judicial Branch Building, which houses the Supreme Court. We're going to be next to the Capitol, which houses the governor and the, and the legislature. We're in the same block in the same neighborhood, and I think that speaks pride to the profession that's been around for so long. It makes us part of the vibrant East Village. Uh, this part of the city of Des Moines has had a rebirth in the last few years. There's uh, housing, uh, retail, uh, nightlife, uh, a number of things which make it the premier location for Des Moines. Ownership in this new facility brings with it financial and logistic benefits, as well as a sense of permanence it has not had before. We have approximately 40 people that attend our meetings that we hold four times a year and the conference room at the current Bar Association is too small for us to hold a meeting there. I think owning our own building sends a message not only to the general public but also to our members and to those people who might want to come to practice law in the future that the Bar Association is an important part of the judicial system and that it's here to stay. The new building with very easy access from Interstate 235 will be more spacious than previous facilities and allow room for more people and a better working space for the staff of the Iowa State Bar Association. Upon entering the new facility, you will be greeted by an inviting vestibule and lobby. In addition to a small lounge, the main level of the building houses the offices of both the executive director and the assistant executive director, as well as two conference rooms and a visiting office. The focal point of the main floor is the spacious North Lounge, complete with a working fireplace. This space will be used for receptions and social gatherings, and together with the adjoining North Conference Room, will be able to accommodate 50 to 80 people. The upper level of the facility consists of more offices and a lounge for visiting attorneys, as well as office space for the Iowa State Bar Association staff.
The highlight of the second floor is the 1,700 square foot continuing legal education center. Members will be able to hold CLE meetings in this state-of-the-art room. The lower level houses more office space and an additional conference room, as well as much needed space for the Iowa State Bar Association print shop. Outside the building will be plenty of parking for staff and guests, a needed feature in downtown Des Moines. While still retaining the historic characteristics and charm, the new Iowa State Bar Association facility will be state-of-the-art. T1 high-speed and wireless internet will be available throughout the facility, while conference rooms will be furnished with projectors, flat panel monitors, and video conferencing equipment. It should be a showcase facility by the time we're done with beautiful woods and beams uh, consistent with this original freight house uh, structure, uh, uh, but up updated and upgraded to a beautiful modern facility. The Raise the Bar campaign uh, is going to ensure that future generations of lawyers enjoy a permanent home, a home that uh, most of us who have been practicing uh, have only dreamed of. Right now, work is being done to renovate the historic building into the headquarters of the Iowa State Bar Association. What is needed is your generous donation to the Raise the Bar campaign. When I think back of all the benefits that I've received over the past seven years, there's no way that I can ever pay the Bar Association back for all the opportunities that I've had. The opportunity to be in on the ground floor of something doesn't always come along. You know, when if you come into this association 15 or 20 years from now, the building's already going to be there, or 40 years from now, or 50 years from now. But we have an opportunity now to say, I was there when we made that decision to do that. Now you have the opportunity to give back to an organization that continues a rich history of service to its members and the community. I think that the Bar Association provides the opportunity for lawyers to pay back for all the good things and the wonderful way of life that we do have. I made my contribution to the Raise the Bar campaign based upon my belief that no other organization has contributed so much to my professional life and to my personal life as has the Iowa State Bar Association. It's going to be a very, very adequate facility, a very good facility, and one that I'm going to be proud of, and I'm, I'm going to be proud that I had some part in it. Support the Iowa State Bar Association's Raise the Bar campaign and help build your legal legacy.